After that, there was just no stopping Mickey and Mallory. They tore up the countryside with their vengeance right out of the Bible. I'm standing on Highway 666, running through towns like Cortez, Shiprock, Sheep Springs, and ending in Gallup, New Mexico. To some, a beautiful stretch of the American landscape, but to Mickey and Mallory Knox, who are still at large, it is literally a candy lane of murder and mayhem. Patrolman Gerald Nash was just the first of 12 peace officers that Mickey and Mallory murdered during their reign of terror. Gerald and his partner, Dale Wrigley, were parked at this donut shop, Alfie's Donuts, when... This 1970 Dodge Challenger pulled up across the street from the donut shop. Gerald was only three weeks out of the academy. Come walking out with coffee. Thanks, folks. My bear claw. Hey, you. Driver. Asked him a question. How the hell do you get to farming? He looked like he was giving street um, directions. Take it down to 324, take it over to 66, and Farmington's up about 65 miles. Quick ride. You folks going there? When he finished, uh -huh. we'll and nice waved time. him thanks, then up come that shotgun. Tragic murder occurred. American bronze medalist marathon bicyclist Brian Schmidt. Woo! I always wanted to take a shot at one of them. They're not so easy to hit. We really raped and pillaged the first show to do this. So. We changed the order around so it wouldn't be super obvious, right? It still needs a new intro, in my opinion. Who is this you guy? cannibalize yourself all the time. Repetition gonna works, shit. David. It's going to wind up with shit. Repetition works, it, Davey. Okay? Do you think that those nitwits out there in the zombie land remember anything? It's junk food for the brains. It's, you know, fill off fodder. Whatever. Look, just build to the interview. Okay? Keep saying that word. Live interview with Wayne Gale.